I'm Barbara, one of the co-founders here at Ponga. We've built a better way to tell stories and pictures. This series focuses on getting the most out of Ponga. I'll show you how to use stories in pictures to weave a fabric of connection you can share with anyone. Using Ponga, your stories are compelling and engaging, yet you have the control to keep them private. As a Ponga member, you can upload your own pictures and use them to tell stories. Invite a few friends and family as a way to lure the stories out of them, too. Members can upload as many pictures as they like in JPEG, PNG, and TIFF format, and no need to downsize to meet file size limits. We'll protect your original image complete with the metadata should you want it back. It's your photo, not ours. As a member, you can also invite as many guests as you'd like to explore your pictures. Your guests register to protect your privacy, but their account is free. Your guests can also upgrade at any time to upload their own pictures. As a member, you can not only add your own pictures, but also have your pictures automatically organized for you by person. That gives you a great head start on exploring the stories in each picture. You share individual pictures, albums of pictures of a particular person, albums you create by yourself, by topic or event. Sharing pictures can be an act of hospitality. When you're sharing with others who were in a picture, a few words can remind them of the event or connection. Ask questions and respond as stories spin and weave. Of course, you can only share your own pictures. There's no resharing. To share a picture, just click on the share panel on a picture or an album, add one or more email addresses, maybe a short message, and boom, that's it. Your guests receive a beautifully formatted email from you with a preview of the image. If they haven't already signed up, they'll be prompted to create an account. Once they're in, we'll show them around with a tour to get them started. What starts as sharing becomes engagement and connection as you, your friends, and family start weaving threads of stories together. Every comment triggers an email so that guests can share in the conversation. Comments become threads, threads become yarns, and yarns tell stories of a deeper connection. Stories connect us to each other when they tell us about ourselves and those we love. When you share stories, you're hosting your guests. Help them feel comfortable. Remind your guests how you are connected and why it matters to the story. Thanks so much for watching. We have more tips for you. Just take a look at the sites here and follow along. Can't wait to see you next.